You guys remember Star, don't you? She was the Greyhound that came to us by airplane and received various medical treatments to deal with the spinal cyst that was causing her mobility issues. Well, Star loves attention, and she told me that she wanted to get in on my most recent video topics of discussing trimming nails, as hers were crazy long when we first got her. So her and I are going to share with you some previously unseen video in this episode of The Great Show of Greyhound. Alright, so a quick recap. An organization called Pilots and Paws flew Star to us all the way from Texas. The farmers who found her on a gravel road weren't sure how long she'd been out there on her own, but she was seriously underweight and her nails were crazy long. The walk from the airplane to the car revealed that Star drug her back legs a lot and just had a hard time moving in general. An animal welfare organization called Critter Crusaders financed an MRI scan which revealed a cyst in the vertebra of her neck that was compressing her spine and numbing her whole body. She's on a steroid now that helps to shrink it and she's doing a lot better. Even though I did five videos about her recovery back to health, I still have so much unused video, especially from those first few days after we brought her home. I had this scene that I removed from the first video, The Flying Greyhound, that features Heather trimming Star's nails immediately after bringing her home from the airport. While editing that video, I removed this scene because it really wasn't relevant to Star's story of recovery. But now that I've recently done several videos about trimming nails with clippers or a grinder, it's very relevant because this is a perfect example of what nails look like when they have not been taken care of. So here's the deleted scene from The Flying Greyhound. And her back feet, the only reason these nails aren't long is because she drags them. And those ones are crazy long. Because yeah, Chip. Thumbnail. Jeez. Okay, I need her laying back. Okay. Shift her. Thanks. Oh, she's like, I'm a little bit nervous again. Girl. Can't believe how long you are. I don't know how long she was running around. Nails don't get like this overnight. No, no, this is a long time. Who knows if she's just been out on her own for a really long time or if whoever had her. Had her, just didn't take care of her. Holy cow, that's like hollow. Nail is so huge, that's yeah, left that's over. over. Yeah, Like, mm -hmm. it's the size of my fingernail. So, explain to me the different color there. So this is where the blood is. Okay, and this so is up where... to that dark line, that's where the blood ends, mm -hmm. and the rest of the nail it's is just, excess. Mm -hmm. Just like your fingernail. Okay. These nails are so long, they've looked pretty different. So she's easy to cut because you can see the blood really well. Mm -hmm. Well, her nails aren't black. Well, like, Wilson has some that aren't black and I still have trouble. <laughs> he doesn't even let you. So, <laughs> so this one under here is clear, but yeah. I still can't see that line. You can see it a little kind bit. Kind of. Just not quite as yeah. huh. clear as hers. Her back nails aren't so bad because he's dragging her feet so much. Yes. Because you notice the outside ones mm -hmm. are long. Oh. And the inside ones are not. Inside get drug worse. That scene was recorded two years ago, and since then I am happy to share with you that Star got adopted. My name is Pat Wilson. I live in Des Moines, Iowa, and I am the new mother to Star. We've gotten to know Pat over the last two years, and she does a really good job with Star. Star's put on some healthy weight, and the steroid helps to shrink down that cyst. She'll never fully recover. That cyst will always cause some minor mobility issues, as well as slightly interfere with the reliability of her bladder and bowel. Because of that, Pat will still put Star in a doggy diaper at bedtime and for longer car rides home. You know, just in case. Speaking of, we now have a little one all our own to put into diapers. This is Ashley, and in the next episode, we're going to share how we introduced our dogs to a newborn baby. A link to that episode, as well as the previous, can be found over here. 
You can watch any other video at youtube.com slash greatshow, and you can subscribe to that YouTube channel with this link down below. Follow us on social media at greatshow. Thank you very much for watching. Have a great day.